Are you ready? Yes. It won't be easy for the people to hear, but the truth often isn't. I know they'll do the right thing. <clears throat> you got this. Yo, what up? So I'm just gonna very quickly try to read the actual letter for you. So if you're interested, stick around. <clears throat> Thank you all for assembling here. I wanted to take time to address some of the rumors that have been circulating around our island. I believe that it is important for the people of this territory to understand the truths and not just because it is fair, but because it is essential in forming decisions. No matter how you feel about the human race, I think we can all agree that the event known as the Fall of Beacon was a tragedy. I think that what happened in, in New York was a tragedy, and Osadom needs to pay the price. Um... <laughs> A tragedy that will set both men and Fauna's kind back. While the main aggressor is still unknown, we do have official confirmation that Adam Torres, the leader of a powerful splinter group working inside the White Fang, was partially responsible for these attacks. His actions not only tarnished the reputation of an organization originally created to bring back peace and equality to all, but to our entire race. With each day that this man remains unpunished, it becomes increasingly difficult to condemn those that look up down upon us, the Faunas. Recently a spy from this same splinter group set their sights on this very home. My own daughter, Blake, and her friend did their best to apprehend this individual. While they were unsuccessful after being physically assaulted and seriously injured, they were successful in obtaining the assailant scroll. With this, we have been able to assert to ascertain that Adam Torres has plans to overthrow the current leader of the White Thing, Sienna Khan, and take over the reigns himself. So that's it. That's it. I don't have much time to analyze, but that's your job. So do it in the comments. I'll see you guys later.